probably one of the reasons why my kids have spent so much time on screens is because it's just because I am my brain is often overwhelmed and there's just too much in it and when kids aren't on screens you know they're they're prone to coming say mom mom can you help me here I want this blah 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 blah. and so it's something that I've had to continually work on myself and um you know the difficult part of it is that when we're overwhelmed often to say okay well you need to do some self-care every day feels like another thing to add to the load and so what I really like about your approach is how can we uh introduce some things during our day that aren't going to take up a lot ever extra time and make us feel more overwhelmed but we can incorporate them into our day so that we can feel calmer and more just more not so much more in control but just a little bit more centered and balanced I think is probably the best way to describe it so um I know I know I can't remember what we came up with we brainstormed some five steps when we had a a chat the, the other week um, but do you want to talk about your fir- the first step that you recommend? Yes. So I try to keep my, my tea to demonstrate it, but it's, it's a little bit cold in the meantime because we didn't really, you know, we had this trouble starting up. But one thing that I noticed when uh, my kids were smaller is that I often just, you know, I prepare tea and I'm really, I'm such a tea lover. I'm like, I always am a tea nerd because I, tea is really my thing. And I often just drank it quickly, like I had to go somewhere, oh, there's still tea, and then quickly drink it and not really enjoy it. And it's so simple to, to get your tea and just, or your coffee, I mean, if you're a coffee lover, of course, to just hold it for a moment and maybe just, you know, smell and look forward to drinking it, but maybe it's still too warm. And then when you drink it, like drink it slowly, I really enjoy it, enjoy the taste. I mean, you're not drinking it. If you want to drink something quickly, I mean, you can drink water, for example, you know. And if you want to drink your warm drink, it's something that you can really take your time and enjoy. And there's there's one thing I always say, and this is not a good example, but if you have a cup that's, you know, not transparent, you can say to your kids, When I'm finished with my tea, then I'll be there for you. Just wait till I finish. And then you can pretend to drink more even when it's finished. (laughs) So (laughs) if, if they, if you mean, if they don't come and like check your cup, because I know there are kids who will do that, but it can, you know, and it's good to, to put a boundary to your kids to say, I'm just drinking this drink and then I'll be there for you. Just wait for a moment. Your kids learn, you know, that, Sometimes mommy or daddy needs time for themselves. Mm. And I mean, they, if it's not very urgent, of course, they can wait. Mm. 